Moving on to diplomatic tensions between India and Canada, they continue to rise. Speaking at the UN General Assembly, External Affairs Minister S. Jai Shankar said that political convenience should not determine the response to terrorism. Canadian diplomat Robert Ray said that international rules cannot be bent for political expediency. In our deliberations, we often advocate the promotion of a rules-based order. From time to time, respect for the UN Charter is also invoked. But for all the talk, it is still a few nations who shape the agenda and seek to define the norms. This cannot go on indefinitely, nor will it go unchallenged nor must we countenance that political convenience determines responses to terrorism, extremism, and violence. Similarly, respect for territorial integrity and non-interference in internal affairs cannot be exercises in cherry-picking. We also have to uphold the values of free and democratic societies. We cannot bend the rules of state-to-state -state relations for political expediency because we've seen and continue to see the extent to which democracies are under threat through various means of foreign interference. During an interaction at Council on Foreign Relations, Jay Shankar said that the government has told Canada that it was not India's policy to engage in acts like killing or deep seeing Niger. Let's listen in. Uh, one, we told the Canadians that uh, this is not the government of India's policy. Two, we told the Canadians, saying that, look, if you have something specific, if you have something relevant, you know, let us know. We are open to looking at it. In the last uh, uh, few years, uh, Canada actually has seen a lot of organized crime, uh, you know, relating to, you know, the secessionist uh, uh, forces, uh, 